In the exhibition, we have two pieces by the artist and feminist activist Cecilia Vicuña. And actually, the title of the exhibition, And If I Devoted My Life to One of Its Feathers, came from a poem she wrote in the late 1960s. In the exhibition, we have a collage called Arbol de Manos, which is uh, a really beautiful piece that she produced in 1974 when she was living in London. And this piece is uh, really um, beautiful and moving because it depicts a group of hands that are trying to rise. And it is um, a tree, as Cecilia describes it, in the sense that it is like a, like a small uh, form of vegetation that is growing but it is also a, a monument to care and solidarity. We can also see this uh, collage as a sort of a flame, you know, like fire that is again rising. And, and I love the position of the hands, you know, the, the gestures. Um, the, the, the two in the middle, the red ones are open. So it is like uh, trying to uh, support, trying to create support, and, and, and the, the, the yellow one on top, it is like pointing out uh, to, to the sky or, 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 or to the ceiling uh, in this case. Um, and it is, of course, trying to um, encouraging resistance um, and, and ways uh, to respond to the dictatorship uh, in Chile at that time. We also have this monumental sculpture, Burn Kipu, which is a, a, a sculpture that Cecilia produced in 2018. And this piece, uh, well, the colors of the piece are evoking uh, smoke and fire. And the piece was produced as a response to the fires in the Amazon and in other places. The installation is like a big kipu, and the kipu is the Inca, the, the Inca uh, recording device used uh, for accounting, but also for telling stories. And Cecilia is uh, reclaiming this um, indigenous Andean uh, form of communication that was banished during the conquest. The sculpture also is um, alluding to, to fluids. Uh, it is like a cascade of energy and, and sensuous uh, forms and, and colors. And in that sense, it's very erotic. The piece is uh, addressing environmental destruction, but in a very, um, I would say, erotic way, you know, in a very jo joyful and colorful um, way. And it's create um, a, a conversation uh, between the earth and the cosmos. Uh, for Cecilia, the kipu is a poem in the space.